What is that? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Not in the middle of the fireworks. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Royal Regency series. We are back with the Royal Family of Windenburg. We have Emily practicing some of her, do they call it piano forte? So she's practicing here. And then we have Prince Henry talking to his mother. I feel like his mother is asking about the ball last night and if there was anyone that caught his eye and she's being a little bit pushy and now it looks like she's like super encouraging him like how important this is. He's like, you need to find a wife. Oh my gosh, Henry. Okay, all right, she thought that was funny. I thought <laughs> she would be like, you need to find a wife and he's like, Bleh. <laughs> no, I do not mother. Also someone said, and I love this idea, that we can pretend that the phones at the ball are dance cards. So they each have dance cards and you have like a certain amount of people you can dance with, I guess. Also someone's calling Prince John. Hey, I heard you became friends with Duke Evans. Okay, we're gonna say phone calls are like letters. How about that? Cell phones, dance cards, sometimes they have their dance card or maybe a letter in their hand, you know? It's just, we're gonna have to deal with it not being everything historical. Also, so this is the day after the debutante ball from the last episode. I still have this set up. I need to set this back up to the normal throne room in Windenburg. But what we are going to do today, so I said that Lady Ella caught Henry's eye. So I'm going to have him call on her. We're gonna pay a visit to Lady Ella. There might be some other suitors. There are three women in that household who are out in society. So Henry might have some competition. We will have to see. I have not seen anyone call on Princess Emily yet. It is literally the next day, very early in the morning though. These are flowers from suitors, but I don't know if these are for Emily or if these are for Henry. I'm also curious, so yeah, we had a peek of the Lady Yapsalot Society papers in the last episode. I'm curious what needs to happen for her to start gossiping and for her to write things in the papers about people. So let's go ahead, we're gonna call on Lady Ella. I'm gonna have Henry pay her family a visit. Okay, we have come to Lady Ella's house and there's a toddler just standing outside in bare feet. <laughs> I'm gonna blow up their family tree in a moment because their family is a little bit confusing. So knock on the start of breaking. No, sir, please. All right, are, are there any suitors here too? Do they have to come in at a certain time? Come on in. Okay, hello. We are here to call on Lady Ella. Where the house is empty. Where is she? Oh no, it's not empty. Okay, here we have Lady Adeline who we did see get into an argument with Princess Emily in the last episode at the ball. Oh, oh, are you already talking to her? Oh, she's coming to greet him right away. He's like, hello. Uh, pretend there's like a butler or something there. Um, although she's still in her debutante. Oh, they're Oh, did y'all see that? Let's change your outfit. Oh my gosh. Hello. Oh, they're, oh my God. They're already flirting, but she's scared. Ooh, what? Why? When is she? Maybe she's nervous. Oh, they're hugging again. They are hugging again. Okay. Incomparable stress from incomparable trait. The queen declared that Prince Henry her diamond, but now Prince Henry can't help wondering if he can live up to her majesty's standards. Okay. Can you get off your phone, Ella, please? Uh, flirt with Finn. Try to console about her being scared. Maybe he's like noticing that she's a little bit nervous. So now he's trying to console her. Okay, and I want to show you who is, oh God, oh my gosh, oh, oh. Um, what was that? <laughs> okay, actions, control sim. First of all, what do you, s <gasps> what are they talking about? She has, she's the paranoid trait. Paranoid sims don't like being around others that are whispering. What are they talking about? Are they talking about me? I want to know what her relationship is like with, I believe, her niece. So let me show you their family tree here. Okay, Lady Ella is the youngest sister of Duke Henry. Duke Henry is like way older than his two sisters. Lady Gwen is also one of 
the oh debutante she, she's out in society as well so we saw her at the ball too so that is lady ella's sister um their parents have been gone for a while now her brother henry inherited the title of duke henry is married to chaya who we also saw and then i don't actually know if i'm pronouncing that correctly it's like chaya or chaya but we saw her in the last episode of the ball as well she was chaperoning her daughter chaya's daughter is lady adeline but then she has a sister anna and anna's daughter is lady reyna who i'm pretty sure is in this household too so the ones out in society are reyna adeline and ella and gwen which is gwen in this household i have to double check so Ella is Adeline's aunt. Um, so this is confusing. So so this niece and aunt are both out in society at the same time. They're around the same age, but so is Adeline's cousin from her mom's side because their aunt Ella and uh, Adeline are aunt and niece from Adeline's dad's side. Oh my gosh, this is a mess. Um, reminder, I have the family tree linked below if you would like to follow along. Adeline seems very catty, like very, very catty. Okay, so relationship wise, Ella and Adeline don't have much of a relationship. I feel like Ella tries to stay far away from Adeline, but they like live together, but they don't get along well, but not to the point where it's like negative, negative. However, I feel like that might change now that they're essentially like competing for each other. Cause what if Adeline's also interested in Henry, but she didn't get a chance to talk about her. So maybe Ella is paranoid because Adeline keeps like talking about her. Maybe Adeline is trying to turn her cousin Reyna against Ella because Reyna and Ella are much closer. What is that? Oh my God. Oh my God. Whoa. Oh my God. I thought he was proposing. I was like, excuse me. Y'all, he picked up her handkerchief for her. He picked up her handkerchief for her. <gasps> Moving too fast from successful romance with unflirty sim. Why won't they slow down with all the romantic advances? Why can't they just take it slow and steady? Henry's moving too fast for her, y'all. Irrational danger from being screamed at. Henry. Y'all, this is so interesting. This is so interesting. So Lady Ella's aspiration is to have uh, is the soulmate aspiration. I think Ezra's is the accomplished one. I'm gonna have to double check. But Henry, maybe you should also introduce yourself to her brother. So her brother's basically her guardian. Gentlemanly introduction with a fan. Do you do this with a fan? I feel like this is already a date. I should have asked him on a, like ask her on a date already. Um, but we're gonna introduce to, oh, oh, oh. Is that the gentlemanly introduction? You guys just became good friends. Wow, that was, I mean, to be fair, I feel like they should know each other a bit he's okay we're, we have to plan the event oh, there's also no other suitors this is a household of three women nobody really there i had all three of them declare intent to marry and nobody's showing up i thought he might have more competition i was kind of hoping he would have more competition i'm not gonna lie but where should we have this chaperone date i mean just here i feel like it should be here i feel like we're already on the date chaperone date okay it doesn't have to be serious but a date is a great way to spend some quality one-on-one -on -one time with a special person who knows where it may lead Yes, one on one time with a chaperone, just there. Chaperone, I think it should be Henry, or wait, no, not Henry, sorry, what, wait, is your name, do wait, what's your name? It is Henry! Oh, this is confusing. <laughs> oh my gosh, let's go here. Let's sit together, sit and chat here. Oh, this would be really romantic, look at this! Oh my gosh, all of them, all of them going, no, Hen other Henry, oh, this is gonna, this is gonna be hard. Duke Henry, uh, what, what's the short name for Henry? Harry! Harry. Okay, I'm I'm going to call her brother Harry. This is do for the sake of not getting too confused. Hopefully we won't like we'll see how long we have to deal with this, but okay, you you do need to let them just kind of like chat and stuff though. Cheese for Okay, so she doesn't like too much of the flirting, but I'm pretty sure Henry is like super flirty. I actually might change his aspiration because people had pointed out that he might be a bit of a rake, which I think would be very interesting. I did download from the hashtag Mirai Townies. I'm gonna put creators of Sims that I downloaded. Thank you for those who made, there was a lot who, okay, so first of all, I have, oh, the chaperone is leaving, um, but I have on my Pinterest board a section for Region CCC. So if you want to download any of those that I am using, you can check there. That is linked below. It's on Pinterest board. Oh my gosh, their chaperone is straight up leaving. Uh, uh okay. 
Okay, I, I don't- okay. A flirt. Let's flirt. Let's see how this goes, because they've got a little bit of a romantic relationship. Also, for those who don't know, in this time, kissing is a no. They cannot kiss before marriage. That would cause a scandal. Like, the biggest scandal. If anybody saw that, hopefully they won't autonomously, auto autonomously kiss. We will have to see. Also, Ella is getting a little bit uncomfortable now. I don't know how sure Ella is of this, especially if Henry is more romantic. I actually might change some of his traits. Hold on, modifying, I don't actually know if this will take us back to the main palace or not. All right, so I'm gonna give him the aspiration reformed rake. The Sim wants to change his rakish ways. So it says he wants to change, but he, okay, but he needs this. So a rake, rakes are lovable scoundrels with an insatiable need for romance and an indifference to commitment. They often find themselves in precarious social situations. Serial romantic. The Sim wants to play the field and go on dates with all sorts of interesting people. Okay, we're gonna start this with serial romantic. So let's see his rake phase before things get too serious. Self-assured, athletic, music. He loves music. He's outgoing. I'm gonna change the active because otherwise he's just gonna be doing push-ups all the time. Let me leave it open for now, and then if another one seems to present itself, then we will go ahead and look at that. Okay, dang, I did not realize that going into create a sim would end the date, so I guess we already ended the date. Okay, I mean, I guess that's okay. Oh, oh, she's doing push-ups. I guess that's okay if the date already ended. It seemed that Ella was a bit uncomfortable, so definitely don't want to push it. I'm not sure if Henry feels anything in particular with her. I feel like he's probably attracted to her. I wonder if Adeline would try to flirt with him. Maybe, maybe a little bit. I'm sure that Chayo would definitely be like, oh, oh, your highness. I feel like she'd rather her daughter end up with the prince. So she's very much pushing for that. So she's like, your highness, let me introduce you to my daughter. We'll pretend that he's introducing himself. Oh, you do already know Lady Adeline. Um, talk about dreams, I guess. Henry's talking to Adeline. I, 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 I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have her try to flirt. Flirtation. Everyone's trying to win the prince's hand here. Flirt with fan. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh. She she did it. She flirt. Oh my god, there's already a romantic relationship. That was really fast. Oh my gosh. Duke Harry came down like, what is going on down here? His wife is like, um, nothing, my lord. <laughs> oh my gosh. <gasps> okay, I think we should get out of here. This, this is, there's a lot going on. So we are now at a gentleman's club in Henford. I made a literal club that says gentleman's and now I'm kind of regretting picking this as their icon because it's above all of them. Not saying all of them are like this. I don't think they all are, but I just, I picked that because I was like, yeah, that makes sense for what we're doing. And then now that's over all of their heads. We have some ladies that work here. I downloaded these from the gallery using the hashtag. So thank you to the creators for making them. It was very helpful. And they're all so cute. Except, no, this one is going away and I, I don't want her to. So how do I, can I just, do I have to introduce myself to you? One of you ladies, can you please ask her? Come back. Okay, she is getting her. She is getting her. Oh, good. And look, we have some of the other townies that are dressed appropriately here. Oh, she's going all the way over here. Okay, okay. All right, this is not, this isn't going well. I, I just, I want the, okay, maybe I'll have to control her too. Is that what we're going to have to do? Henry has a pristine reputation. Ooh, do we think that might change? Here's the thing. Back then, if there was a rake, it was a man. And no one seemed to care that much. Not that much. I remember there was like the one Baron Nigel in Bridgerton in the first season and he got a maid pregnant and then like sent her away before she had the baby and then didn't send her money and that ruined his reputation. So these ladies work here. It looks like one of them is already helped. I didn't change their names so, uh, from what I downloaded them. So this is Miyoko. She's dancing right next to the gentleman and like chatting 
going with all of them. You, sir, are not dressed for this. So I'm going to have to ask you to leave. I am so sorry. You're very handsome. Um, but, oh, oh my god. No, no one, no one can just walk in. Please just go away. I do really want to get to know the others as well. I know that Sahar is a bit more awkward. Prince Sahar is. And William is a bit more outgoing, I believe. And he doesn't get along that well with his brother, Neil, over here. Um, so I, okay, I literally, she's dancing right here. I wonder if any of these men are like interested in her. So that's Miyoko. Har, oh, 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 there, wait, where did she go? Harmony was literally just, is she leaving again? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. See, gentlemanly introduction. And then we'll do a gentlemanly introduction to you too. And then if Harmony comes back, we'll do one for her as well. Wow, they became, okay. All right, that's a little too fast, I think. Doing a gentlemanly introduction apparently makes them like love you immediately, but he barely knows this girl. So I, I, I put the relationship back down. It's probably gonna be the same situation with June over here. Um, And so also, just so you guys know, we, I probably should have said this earlier. We are paying more attention to Henry in this episode. I figured in the next episode, we'd have a ball. I think Willow Creek will be hosting a ball at the palace and I'm hoping we can focus a bit more on Emily. And then because Emily and Henry are the main characters, I thought we could in the future have an episode that focuses on some of the other royals like the Oasis Spring sisters and also Neil over here as well. So that way we, you guys can see them, but we still have like our main characters that we focus on a bit. Oh, are they dancing in the middle of the club? They are. Oh my. Did you introduce yourself to June? You do know her a bit. Okay, I need to control them just so I can see their personalities, but actions control Sim. I feel weird like telling them to do this stuff because in real life I'd be like, you want to be a player and everyone's consenting to things, that is fine. But just, I don't feel like, I feel like the standards are not fair. So it feels weird doing this, but I must for the sake of the series. Oh, oh, Neil is dastardly jealous. I feel like he's jealous of his brother. And then William, I just need to double check what you are like, sir. He's romantic. I feel like, oh, are you, oh, you are also going to be a bit of a reformed rake. Who will be the rake? of the rakes. <laughs> who, who will it be? Where the heart is, looks like Prince William just befriended a homebody sim. Homebodies are sim that often prefer the quieter life. They tend to enjoy calmer, craft-related hobbies rather than rock Yes, adventure seeking. They might also be a bit more introverted than other Sims. Would you say that William likes homebody Sims? This is foreshadowing. Yes, I would a hundred percent. So loyal, like a golden retriever. Looks like Prince William just befriended a pet enthusiast. Oh, pet enthusiasts just can't get enough of their. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, June. <laughs> Can I not do a flirty introduction? with you? Okay, I'll do a friendly one first. If they're gonna be rakes, we have to rake up their history, you know? Okay, these girls here are... It feels so weird saying this, but they're not, like, back then considered ladylike, so they're... They don't have an issue with affection and stuff, so we're gonna... I mean, we should definitely, like, flirt first, but, um, we're gonna go ahead and do that. William, I gotta rake up your history here, so why don't you go ahead and flirt with June? Oh my god. Wow, he gets romantic relationships fast. He has one with Miyoko already. Okay, oh my god, she's kissing her hands. Wait, is he gonna get a bad reputation, though, if they see this? Like, if it's someone not in... Uh, wait, hold on. Oh my god, she's giving her a rose. Oh my god, she is so into this. Okay, okay, listen, y'all. <laughs> This feels so wrong. I feel like I'm derailing completely here. Um, <laughs> I put a bed. Relax together. Will she come with? Oh no, oh wait, no, someone else is coming up too. Wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, ah, what are y'all doing here? No, oh, did I say relax together like everybody? No, 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 no. I didn't mean all the men. Oh my God, whoops. I did not mean all the men. I mean, if you want to, but no. <laughs> I, I just met Miyoko. Oh my gosh, William asked June to dance and now his brother Neil is like, I'm a way better dancer than my brother. Look at me. <laughs> That's amazing. I'm obsessed. 
Oh my god, sir, you are all up in your brother's business. Okay, why don't you flirt with her for a little bit? How about that? Their romantic relationship isn't going up as fast, so Henry definitely... His hands. Ooh, ooh, what if you do that? Henry's goes up way faster. They like flirt once and literally have a romantic relationship. Men are, maybe Henry's the more charming one. Maybe that's it. William, I think, okay, well now they've got a romantic relationship. William, I think is also charming, but maybe Henry, I mean, he's the incomparable. So maybe that's just a benefit of being the incomparable. He's confessing his attraction to June. Neil is not letting down, is he? Sahar, what are you up to? We'll focus on them soon for sure. Sahar, are you talking to yourself in the mirror? Are you trying to give yourself a pep talk because that's adorable? Sahar's also a bit awkward. I, I think he's unflirty. He's definitely a bit awkward. He's socially awkward. Let's see. How are things going with Henry? Oh! Are you trying to seduce her, sir? She seems pretty into it, not gonna lie. <gasps> First kiss. First kiss. Should we do it? There's, there's people around. Someone might... Oh, actually, there, there's there's not really anybody around. Oh my god! It literally, if anyone sees, it could cause a scandal. So I I don't see anybody. I don't see anybody around. All right, first kiss. Do it. 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 They're having their first kiss. Oh my! Oh oh my god! Okay, she didn't see. Oh thank god. Thank okay, nobody saw that. No one saw that, y'all. We are good. Here's the thing. I don't think they have to, like, sleep with these women for them to be rakes. You know, I feel like just having these romantic relationships and then just being a flirt, like, maybe some of them will act on it. Henry's clearly already acted on it. Oh, now they're arguing. Uh-oh, oh, oh. They got their, their... Oh, things are going down. Things are going downhill. Neil is still dancing. He's happy about it, I guess. This is interesting. Oh, my God. They're having a steamy exchange, y'all. They're having a steamy... Things just keep going up. Henry could never marry this woman. I don't, like... I wonder how into her he is, though. I don't know. I didn't feel like they were going to be that into it each other uh, their friendship went up really high though i i don't know i feel like oh woohoo <gasps> Do I do it? Do we do it? Do that, that, that's risking some- Oh! Somebody's watching them! Somebody's watching- Oh, she's giving a massage. That's okay. That is okay. You're my- What did that say? You're my person. I love hanging out with you. Maybe we could make it official? He, he would never be allowed to marry her. Ever. Like a- like a bar girl? What are they- like a- what are they called? She- I mean, she works at the Jetta Wins Club. She, he would never be allowed to marry her. Uh, but I don't know how into her he is. I feel like he's not- like, she's the one saying, like, maybe we should make it official. Like, maybe we should do this. So I feel like he's not that into her. Y'all, I'm so tired. I feel like we should do the woohoo. He's a rake! He's a rake! Y'all have seen Bridgerton. I feel like we should do the woohoo thing. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. This feels so wrong. Please don't get pregnant. Please don't get pregnant. You're not on the family tree. Maybe they wouldn't want a bastard baby to be on the family tree. I'm hoping you don't get pregnant, though. That That's a whole level of... I don't know. Uh, okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh my, Wait, did... Y'all, did you see he had, like... The picture of her with the cross through, so I'm taking that as he's not really that into her. He's a scoundrel. He's a rake. The men are still dancing in here. Sahar's still giving himself a pep talk. Poor innocent Sahar! Oh my god, is this actually happening? Is this gonna happen? Is this happening? Is this happening? It's happening. It's happening. It's happening! Nobody saw. Nobody saw. I really, I don't think it'd be a huge deal. I, well, you know what? No, I think the mod is programmed. So like whether, whoever it is, whatever gender it is, it is a big deal. Oh my gosh, y'all. William has a kiss June want. I don't think she's here anymore, but he wants to kiss her. Okay, so Henry and Miyoko are up there. Oh my gosh, is this... <gasps> Okay, William is in a group chat. It says with Lady Ezra. Is she? She is here. Oh, wait, who is this? Oh my god, is that Ella? No, 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 no. It's someone else. It's a fan. Okay, Ezra is here. I don't know why she would be here. I don't know why Ezra is here. I Maybe, maybe is she friends with William? Yeah, okay, they're, they're like good friends friends this wouldn't make any sense i don't think a lady would be at the club i'm i'm out of ideas but what if what if what if she walks in on this what if she i don't know why 
What if, okay, what if she's downstairs and then she's, I don't know, using the restroom and she hears something and she's like, what on earth is that? Because I don't know, they they're, they don't know that much, you know, back then. Like the ladies, their mothers wouldn't tell them like anything. So what if she hears something and she's like, what on earth is that? Oh my God, are they still doing, <gasps> they're still going, they're still going, they're still going. And now she walks up and, oh my God, oh my God, oh no, oh no, oh no, not in the middle of the fireworks. <gasps> Very uncomfortable. Nauseated from privacy violation, the Osta, she, does she, oh my god, okay, she see, scandal witness, Prince Henry was just seen engaging in inappropriate behavior, maybe the person who saw will be willing to keep things quiet if Henry asks, are they not stopping, are they not, a scandal from witnessing scandal, Ezra, no, don't go back in there, don't go back in, you literally went back and saw it, I guess she had to like, double check and make sure what she saw was correct. <laughs> Ezra, why do you keep going in? Why do you keep subjecting your- Is she like curious? Does she know what they're doing? No, 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 no! Oh my god, oh my god, who are you? Charlotte, a fan! Yo, 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 get out, get out, get out, get out! Okay, did she react to that at all? Ma'am, you need to go. I don't think she saw. She's too obsessed with Lady Ezra. To s oh, she fainted. Oh, and she's leaving. Oh my god. Henry, you need to have a conversation with Ezra. You need to have a conversation. She just witnessed this. She just witnessed this. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Yoga's getting out of bed too. I, I had another outfit picked for her since it was the- Oh! <laughs> oh, they're cool. All is good. Oh no, the relationship's going down. Wait, what did she say? How can I like beg her to not say anything? Are you flirting with her? Oh, oh! <gasps> No, 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 no. I don't think Ezra would be about this. I, I honestly, deep conversation. I don't, I swear there should be an interaction for this. Like literally anything. Okay, she's yelling at him though. And he's yelling back. Why can't you do anything about, I want you to do something about the scandal. You saw something, Ezra. You seem to have been the only one who saw anything. Please, I, I wanna see the slap with fan interaction. She's just arguing with him right now. Oh my gosh, and Miyoko's just walking on by. She's just walking by, she's like, don't mind me. Please slap him with your fan, Ezra. I need to see this, 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 I need to see this. <gasps> Mischief, not so much. Lady Ezra doesn't feel right about all these tricks and games. Should she turn a new leaf and accept that she doesn't like a mischief? That's hilarious because Henry is mischievous. She doesn't like his mischief side. Yes, I love, they're very opposite. And now he's flirting with her? No, 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 no. Oh my, okay, okay. Well, you know what? I'm gonna leave it at that. I feel like she had this idea of him in her head, but she saw something and we're gonna have to see if she keeps quiet about it. Okay, so again, we did focus a bit more on Henry in this video. In the next episode, we will have the ball at Willow Creek, which Henry and Ezra will both be at. But I also want to try to focus on Emily a bit more too, and then maybe we can see some of the other royals as well. We'll see what kind of drama ensues. So yeah, but I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.